My friends, my family, we are in an age of complete deception. We are in an age where we carry on traditions of men and we have no idea why. We were born into traditions and we keep the traditions because that's what traditions are all about. But yet we forget things and we don't study our Bibles. We don't realize that in Jeremiah it tells us we should not take a tree into our house like the pagans do. If you guys brought a tree into your house this year, then you're still a pagan. Because pagans are people against what our creator has. You're either with Yah or you're against him. And this, you have to pull the pieces out of this. And I just don't hear that many people preaching against holly days, right? Holidays, the jokes on them. Holly is satanic. It's all it's all about like Hollywood, holly days. Taste kick and listen to this and just understand a couple of things. Of the Savior. And we're also gonna talk about why it is that we even celebrate Christmas knowing of its pagan origins and that Jesus was not born on December 25th. So uh, are we good? Is everybody okay with that? We're going to talk about that. That'll be at 1115 uh, today. <clears throat> so they still celebrate Christmas, even though our Messiah was not born on the 25th, and it stems from pagan roots. So once you guys wake up and understand this, then you will want to do what our creator wants us to do. If we still want to get under Nimrod's phallus with round red balls all over it and get on our knees, bow to it as we get our presents and have your kids bow to Nimrod's phallus as well. Well, then I guess you're a pagan. <laughs>